What's up, guys? I'm just enjoying a nice Sunday afternoon with my family uh, at home. We're about to go out. I um, was in the mood to review some things, so I'll go ahead and get started. So I picked up this uh, Metrex pancake mix after trying it at the San Jose Fit Expo yesterday. I bought this at Vitamin World. It was on sale. It's normally around $20-something. dollars. It was $12.50, and then I had a $4.50 rebate and a $5 coupon. So I ended up paying $3 for this. I had it last night with a little bit of banana mixed in, and it was delicious. This morning, I uh, made the batter, didn't add anything, and put it in the waffle maker and made a waffle. Um, the single serving wasn't quite big enough for the whole waffle, so it made like a, maybe a two-thirds of the size of a waffle. So it'd have to go with a little bit more mix, but uh, it tasted great. Excuse me. And the macros on this are really good. The only thing you add that you have to add to this is water. And it's two and a half fat, 31 carbs with uh, three grams of fiber and 12 grams of protein. So I definitely recommend this and it was pretty filling. Um, I've been meaning to do a review on this for quite a while. Excuse me, Christian. This is a, a camera I've had since uh, a couple days before the Contra Costa show back in May. So I've had it a good amount of time right now. And it's the Samsung, come a little closer. It's a Samsung Galaxy camera. It has Android operating system on it. It's got a 21 times zoom. And uh, I believe I paid $449 for this. It's a 16 megapixel digital camera. But because it's got Android operating system on it, I can have um, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, uh, pretty much any app. You know, it's got a home key right here. You hit the home key. Um, it's got, no, it's okay. They don't need to see. It's got Dropbox support. So it comes up, you know, it's got. Um, Gyro in, in, in it, so I mean, you literally, you could play games, you could read, you could watch movies, read books on this. You can use it for a lot more than a camera. It came in handy when I was in Vegas and my uh, phone got stolen. But uh, the, the main reason I got it, I was going to get a Sony Handycam, but I decided to go ahead and get this instead because it has 21 times zoom, which is plenty, and it has all the other features that I can use as well. So, very um, multi-purpose. Um, and I like it a lot, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a multitasking kind of guy, so you know, I can, I can literally zoom all the way and get a crystal clear picture, 21 times optical. So, um, I really recommend this, uh, it's great for making videos, tripod support, um, I bought one of those little gorilla pods to stick to um, gym equipment and use in the gym. So, definitely recommend this, I still use my iPhone from time to time like I'm using right now. Uh, let's see, what else did I want to review? Oh. Uh, I just recently beat the PlayStation 3 game, The Last of Us, and I enjoyed it a lot. I've been waiting for this game for quite a while. Um, a lot of, I actually don't own a PlayStation, so I borrowed one from a friend, and I got the game from Redbox for $2 a night. Um, I had the game for nine, nine days, and that's how long it took me to beat it, so it cost me about $18. Um, I would give it a 9 out of 10. A lot of places give it a 10 out of 10, but there was so much hype on this game. I mean, literally waiting for it for a year. It was featured at 2012 E3 and uh, it just came out a few weeks ago. So um, I, I liked it. I won't give away any spoilers on the story. I recommend um, if you like any survival games, if you enjoyed the movie The Road or you like The Walking Dead, um, TV show or comic book, then you'll enjoy the game. But there were, I, I think they could have uh, handled the pacing a little bit better. Um, the game could have been a little bit longer. And, uh, and it could have been a little bit more fun. But overall, it was a great game. I recommend it. Uh, like I said, solid 9 out of 10. But not a 10 out of 10 because it, it just wasn't super fun. Like, I think I actually had more fun playing Tomb Raider, which I, which I played recently. Um, but anyway, that's my review. That's my take. Uh, if you guys have any questions or want my opinion on anything, just let me know. If you enjoyed the video, uh, let me know in the comments. Like the video, share it, and don't forget to subscribe. Cue the outro. Later. Hey, later. Hey, later.